Hi, I'm Louise Meehan from Flight Radar 24, the world's most popular flight tracking service based here in Stockholm, Sweden. In this video, I'm going to show you step by step on how to build and set up your own ADSB receiver. But don't worry if you don't catch it all. We'll also put some links in the description below that you can refer to later. And if you're unsure about where to buy the different parts, that's all included there as well. Our network is currently made up of over 35,000 data sharers. Each one of them is crucial to adding to our global coverage, so thank you so much for being part of that. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is download our Pi24 image from our website and then burn it onto an SD card. You'll find detailed instructions for this at the Add Coverage section of our site. The direct link is below. If you want to configure Wi-Fi directly on the Pi, plug the SD card back into your computer and navigate to it. There you'll find a file named wpa supplicantconf Open it and enter your router name in SSID and the password in PSK within the quotes. Save the changes to the file and eject the SD card. Keep in mind that the WPA underscore supplicant.conf file is removed from the boot directory after the first boot. If you enter incorrect credentials and your Raspberry Pi doesn't come online, you will either need to use a cable to bring the Pi online and change it, or you will have to repeat the image writing process and enter the credentials again. Right, here we go, it's the easy bit now. Next, Insert the SD card into the bottom of your Raspberry Pi like this and press it in. Then take your ADSB dongle and insert the USB into the port like that. Next, you'll screw on your antenna cable onto the ADSB dongle. Now you're ready to plug into the power. Once it's connected, you'll see some lights flashing. Now head back to our site and find the Share Your Data page. Again, we'll link that below, but as you can see, it's right here under the Add Coverage menu. If you scroll down, you'll see a link to activate your Raspberry Pi. Our system will automatically detect it and ask you to register it. And that's it. Once your feed is online, you'll receive an email from us with instructions on how to activate your complimentary Flight Radar 24 business subscription. If you run into any issues, you can always contact our support team at support.fr24.com. Welcome to the Flight Radar 24 community.